broken, but what can I do? Barbara Phillip tells us her husband, Desmond Phillip, could have lost his life when a bullet shattered a window of his work truck and hit him in the chest. It was late Wednesday afternoon. Philip was driving to pick up his lunch near Rochester Avenue and Eastern Parkway. Now Barbara is thankful her husband is alert and talking. After the shooting, she says she received a frantic phone call. A friend of mine called me and let me know what happened. She says at first her husband had no idea he had been hit until he felt pain and saw blood. Police say this man seen in surveillance images was aiming his weapon at a group across the street but missed and hit Philip instead. Philip is a family man who runs his own construction business. Hard working, loving, wonderful person, very good father and I have what can I say? Everything just fall apart yesterday. Police say after causing so much chaos on the streets, the suspected gunman ran into the Utica Avenue train station. This is not the first time an innocent bystander was shot on this block. In September, 17-year-old Shema Roman was hit by a stray bullet. She did not survive. Police say shootings are down in the 77th precinct, but not near Rochester Avenue. Since March, there have been at least five shootings here. While this wife and mother prays her husband makes a full recovery, she also prays gun violence will turn around in the city. We need more help. We need more of everything. This is crazy. What's going on? New York City is falling apart, and the innocent is paying for it. Philip is in stable condition at a hospital. His family is at his bedside. If you have any information on this, call Crime Stoppers. The number is 800 577 tips. In Crown Heights, Nicole Johnson, PIX11 News.